a mysterious black hole larger than a billion suns at the dawn of time. The black hole. In the epoch known as the Cosmic Dawn, which encompasses the first billion years after the Big Bang, astronomers have discovered an extraordinarily large black hole. This black hole resides at the center of the galaxy named J1120 plus 0641 and boasts a mass exceeding that of a billion suns. While even larger black holes exist today, what makes this one unique is its formation period. Estimated to have formed around 770 million years after the Big Bang, the rapid growth of this black hole in such a short cosmic timeframe is a puzzling phenomenon. A surprisingly ordinary giant. Scientists have known about this galaxy and its black hole for over a decade, with initial theories explaining its formation. However, recent observations using the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, have challenged these ideas. Data from JWST reveal that J1120 plus 0641 appears shockingly normal, suggesting more exotic explanations for its mass increase are plausible. Discovered in 2011, J1120 plus 0641 was the most distant known quasar galaxy for several years and remains an outlier in terms of its size. Quasar galaxies and Eddington limit. Quasar galaxies are characterized by their central supermassive black holes feeding rapidly on surrounding gas and dust. The friction and gravitational forces heat this material, causing it to glow brightly. However, a black hole's feeding rate is not unlimited, constrained by the Eddington limit. If the accretion exceeds this limit, the intense radiation pressure can counteract gravity, pushing material away and halting the feeding process. Super Eddington Accretion Black holes can temporarily surpass this limit, entering a phase called Super Eddington Accretion, where they consume as much material as possible before radiation pressure intervenes. This process might explain the rapid growth of early universe black holes like the one in J1120 plus 0641. To confirm this, astronomers need high-resolution data, which JWST provides. Detailed observations by JWST. In early 2023, JWST observed J1120 plus 0641 and a team led by Sarah Bossman from the Max Planck Institute for Astronomy analyzed the light to catalog the material around the black hole. They found a significant dust cloud and a bright disk feeding the black hole. This analysis showed that the black hole is accreting material in a typical manner, similar to younger quasar galaxies, without signs of extraordinary growth mechanisms. A normal giant in an extraordinary epoch. J1120 plus 0641 appears to be a normal quasar galaxy with a supermassive black hole that was already relatively mature just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Bosman states that these new observations make the mystery even more intriguing, as early quasars seem surprisingly normal across different wavelengths. Theories on rapid growth The Super Eddington accretion theory might not fully explain the growth of these early black holes. Another prominent theory is that these black holes formed from very large seeds, the collapse of stars with masses hundreds of thousands of times that of the Sun, giving them a head start in growth. Future Discoveries and Understanding As astronomers discover more of these massive black holes from the universe's early stages, the idea of large initial seeds becomes less strange and might be the best explanation for this mysterious period in cosmic history. Sources Science Alert Nature Astronomy